A 13-year-old boy who is both athletic and artistic needs a forever family. Yeah, meet Skyler and tonight's children are a gift. I'm basically interested in sports and video games. Skyler feels at home on the basketball court. But after spending a couple of years in the foster care system, he is ready to be part of a family. I would probably just want a foster brother. I get uh, like the same age as me. Skyler is an easygoing teenager. Yes, thanks. If I want to play basketball, I'll just probably get my friends to see if they want to play basketball or something like that. Or I'll probably just play the Xbox or something. His favorite video game is Sticks. It's kind of like a stealth game, like Batman a little bit. Mm -hmm. Except it's, uh, uh, except it's where there's a goblin and uh, his name is Styx. Skyler's favorite subject in school is right in line with his hoop dreams. I mean, I like PE a lot. But he also enjoys science class. Science just fascin fascinates me. A lot of stuff that you can learn out there, like in a solar system and stars. Skyler dreams of being a basketball player one day, but also thinks about being a police officer. So that way I can eventually probably stop all the bad stuff that's going on in the world. Skyler needs a family who is patient and accepting of him. What? They would encourage his creative side while providing structure for his education, since he's already been through a lot in his 13 years. My mom's friend took us over, and then after that we moved to a shelter, and then, we moved, and then me and my brother moved to uh, two separate homes. Skyler hopes for this in his forever family. They won't fight. Like they do fun stuff and I guess loving. And he wants people to know what kind of child he is. Hey. I'm a good kid and hopefully I would know better not to do stupid stuff like certain kids do. Yes, a good kid. And for another look at Skyler's story, you can just go to cbs19.tv, click on the exclusives tab at the top of the page, and then select the children are a gift box.